Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Call by Call. Yes, I am back. Uh, it's been a long time, so just to let you know on the story, uh, what I've been doing. I've been uh, very busy lately with work, so I've been uh, doing almost what almost uh, t my two jobs, uh, two jobs going on, and it's been kind of crazy and such. So. I would try to do this on occasion. I, I'm not going to try to do this every week because that's a lot of too much information. So I'm trying to do this when I have the time to do it. So um, so just to let you know on that front. And so this will be the dub version uh, you see um, on my games. So uh, just to let you know, in the last month I went to Southwest, basically Las Vegas and Scottsdale. And I played some games. So this will be the first video. This is at the Midway. At Circus Circus in Las Vegas, and yeah, so I heard about the the carnival games, and yeah, and wanted to play them. So this is my this is my video of that. Uh, you can see the original version on my personal page. You can take a look into that a little more detail. This is more the dub version of the action that you see in these games. So I started off playing uh, uh, Monster Drop Extreme. Uh, yeah, so in this one, I'm just trying to get the jackpot, and yeah, yeah. There, as you see, there one of the balls got stuck there, so I I was trying to figure out why it was stuck, so I had to hit again, and then two balls came out, and then decided to do uh, another re up in this case, uh, just get another place set here because that was crazy. So I added in five plays here, so just trying to aim for the jackpot. Seen bass around, so not a good number. That's that's an eight right there. All right, here we go again on my place. Another miss. Uh, yeah. So sorry for the. I'm not the world's greatest camera person here. I just do it on my own and such. So just to let you know on that front. All right, so three plays left. I think I got the mystery value on that one. I did. All right. Here we go. And the boss was loading up in this one, so here we go again. And I see that ball still lying there. All right. Uh, not go anywhere and such. All right. So. That one is like, huh. bonus ball. No, nothing there. So just trying to get uh, yeah, trying to get the jackpot here. Not getting any luck so far. Oh, actually, I did hit the uh, the um, the drop bonus ball. So I it was only five. So it. Basically, it was nothing. So I got something out of it, but uh, wasn't that too exciting, <laughs> really. Not didn't get a high total amount, and the wheel stopped for some reason. Huh. I don't know how I did that, but anyway. All right, so here we go. Now, really trying to get the jackpot. Nothing there. Um. Well. I got a two, uh, I really love the two there, so yeah. And this is the final one. Nope. Oh, oh there's the jackpot. And yep. Yeah, we got the jackpot on that one, so yeah, that was 596. So, and just to let you know, the prizes were okay, like for the midway. Uh, there, not necessarily the biggest. The biggest prize was basically an Apple AirPods, and also you can get a guitar there. But they were basically so okay. This is uh the Elot machines here, the claw machines at the Midway. I just played a couple of them. Um, I was just testing out the claw, what it is, if it's on payout or not, and look at the claw, see the action. Okay, got a good round it. Then close, so it is definitely on payout. So, and just for good measure, I'm trying to get one near the shoot. Uh, yeah, no lift, so no bueno, 
No brainer. All right, so this is the uh, the bushel toss game. And look at that kid throw. That's cool. Didn't make it to the, to the bushel, but what? It's cool. So here's me. So trying to get three plays, uh, fifty credits, I believe. That's it. So so that's a little bit tricky on the bushel and the top toss. So the top toss, I. I think that I mixed this up. So the top toss, you actually want to throw it to the side because of its surface. For the bushel, you try to hit into the to the rim, the bottom rim of it. On this one, yeah, as you see here, I was on a roll. I I got my first two in, so I was on a roll. I, I was so hot on this case. But after this, so watch this next play. That was a miss. So I got the like the small price here but I uh, after that I was on a terrible cold streak I wanted to get four wins um, because I thought I was doing very well but I think I overemphasized about the side um, buckets and you see I'm fast forward right now so yeah I was in a terrible cold streak so as you see here I was spending a lot of credits on trying to get a third win in this one, I wanted to get like the big prizes, but I just realized, nah, it's just way too much in this case. So, yeah, it was tossing. And here's the last, the third win. Got it. Finally done with that. So, yeah, and I got the medium prize. So, I got the blue medium sloth, as you see on the above here. And there it is. Look at that cutie. Alright, now the goblet toss. Oh, it's. It's a fun game, but man, it's pretty hard to aim, to aim on this one. I don't know how to aim it. Like, do you toss it like, uh, was it crap style, or toss it up in the air and let fate take over? Because the as you see, the edges doesn't um doesn't hold it very well. So it's not like a, a pretty factor. It, it goes down quickly. You just need a you need a lot of speed for that one. So I just basically try to toss it up to and such. And as you see, I did get the the win. It was a small prize. It's a red, so I got one of these uh, small outlets. Now I'm gonna give this credit to a uh, winner every time. I've seen their videos on TikTok and on YouTube. They love playing this game. So in this one, I just know you have to elevate it and aim it good. It takes a lot of practice on my end and such. So. Yeah, and that one I got very close. Next one, eh, short on that one. This, ooh, close on that one. So, try it again on my end. Alright. Another three balls. Into the milk carton or milk jug, whatever they call it now, these days. Okay, that was a terrible toss in front of it, but there you go. One in, third one, I don't care. Alright. And got the prize. So I originally want to get the dog, but I didn't realize that little warthog or the pig was available. So, uh, so I first decided with the dog, but with the warthog by itself, I wanted that, and uh, yeah, so I got that. So there's there's that prize. And now this is this is the uh, monster drop, just plain old monster drop, no extreme, just regular monster drop. And then I got lucky in this one. I hit the jackpot there for some odd reason. I got the jackpot. And then, yeah, I got lucky in this account. And as you see later on, I did hit the 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 drop bonus balls that were 11. Didn't get any of the monster jackpot and such. But, yeah, that was cool. And as you see there, that's the, uh, that's the win I got. Yeah, it didn't accumulate to nothing anyway, so it is what it is. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, that's basically it. I I I the total was very low for that for like eleven balls, so it was a bit of a disappointment, but it was cool. It was cool. Alright, this is the last game I played uh before I left. This is Zombie Snatcher. So uh, I was trying to get uh, trying to get over ten thousand tickets in this case. So yeah, I'm trying to swipe all of it to make sure I'm just wasting all my uh, tickets there. So just trying to get the five hundred and get over ten thousand uh, tickets. So 
yeah, again, terrible angle on my camera here. So, yeah, this was pretty hard and such. So, I, now, just to let you know, spoiler alert, I did win the 500 tickets. I just didn't aim the camera low. So, I'm just getting, taking this out, I guess. So, as you see, the ticket runnings and such. So, yeah, this, the time into this, in this place is a little bit tricky. Oh, I almost got that one. So, it's a it's a little bit tricky. So like each different zombie snatch is different. Like from each one, David Buster has a different setup. And then yeah, I that's when I hit the the five hundred tickets. So I reviewed my um, credits. So no money because I'll be le I was leaving the next day and then got ten thousand eight hundred tickets. And then I realized there was a cart. So that would have been useful if I saw that, but I did not and such all right so those are the prices that i won so that is that at the midway at circus circus it's pretty fun so uh if you try to visit go over there but don't try to go stay in the hotel rooms all right so uh in my ne next personal video i will do a round one video the original version you see and then next week i will do the dub version doing the commentary of those plays all right so that's that i'll see you all in the next time bye